to be or not to be prolific, but that <laughs> is not in question if Heather and I are involved. But we know two people who are bringing Shakespeare to life with a twist. Charles <laughs> Stoney Richards and Jennifer Tober are once again the brains behind a new play for Pittsburgh's Shakespeare in the Park series. Yeah, hard to believe, but Shakespeare in the Park is celebrating 20 years <laughs> just like PTL. Congratulations. That is Congratulations. fantastic. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. It's really a feat. So tell us about this could be true. This is the new play. Well, you know, first of all, your last guest asked us to give her a tip. And I uh -huh. was like, come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's called This Could Be True. And it's about an actor, a present day actor, who suffers from a syndrome called misidentification syndrome. So he doesn't really know who he is. He thinks, as an actor, and that's me playing this guy, uh, thinking that he is a member of Shakespeare's acting company. And the doctor and the nurses that are taking care of him in the asylum that he is in use every method they can think of, professional, they even come up with a little scheme, a little humor, to somehow bring him back to the bridge of reality so he can cross over. And as I was writing this, uh, I kept thinking, well, this is, there's this and there's that. But then, knowing the world that we live in, I kept saying to myself, this could be true. And I thought, that's what this is. It's theater, it's imagination, and it could be true. Because a lot of people do suffer from these kind of things. Yeah, and it's right? a comedy. And, and, and it's a comedy. And we should comedy. say that, yeah. Because it does sound, yeah, like it could be serious. But you guys always find ways to celebrate Shakespeare. And there's a reason to celebrate Shakespeare, sure. right? Yeah. He has a big birthday. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, not <laughs> an unalive birthday. Well, yeah. you know, and that's but part it still of our counts, trip. Should, right? we, should we, I don't want to give it away because we have a little quiz for you. Oh, oh good. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Can we, okay. Yeah. Can we start oh. the quiz? All right. All right, you're okay. going to quiz All us. Right. And it's just whoever gets it first. When? And I'm bad at I'm bad at quizzes. I'm bad at games. I can we'll play see. hockey. That's my only game. Okay, I don't want to see your paper that we okay. When, yes. okay. when was Shakespeare's birthday? Uh, he didn't well, well it, it, next would, week. April twenty third. April twenty third. Yeah. You got it. <laughs> okay. Well it, thanks. It just came to us. <laughs> yeah. In the play Romeo and Juliet, mm. what is the name of Juliet's boyfriend? Rocky. Rocky. Romeo. Julie. <laughs> you got oh. it. It was an R, though, Stoney. Okay. You were, okay. you were really close. Julie. Yes. Right. No. In, right. in, I don't need this. In the play Hamlet, yeah, yeah. who, which character says the famous to be or not to be speech? Hamlet? Hamlet's father saying, is it to be or to be? And you got no? it. No? <laughs> Once again. <laughs> no. I, we okay. love, we I love that you're totally taking a dive and, on this for us, <laughs> Pittsburgh's greatest actor. Uh, oh, Stoney, Stoney Richards. Richards. Oh, I, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> like how I'll this take works. That. Yeah, I love your humility. Lovely, I love lovely, it. lovely. I see oh. how you get some of your stuff, though. You, you use a little bit of the nods from Shakespeare, and then you just make it your own, like sure, Rocky sure. and. Yeah. He, so, steal, he steals girls. it. He I will. Thanks a lot. I appreciate it. <laughs> That's very good. And you really do find that there's an appetite for this. Obviously, yeah. 20 yeah. years going on. Yeah. And you guys make it fun, right? We try. We yeah. try to, we, we bring, usually, this is a fundraiser for us, but usually we do free Shakespeare in city parks and found spaces. And yeah, so we bring fun. art to the people, and we have music, we have baby pools full of water, we have dancing, we have disco. I was we have say, beautiful what? costumes. Look at well, that. I was handed like, this necklace, but I'm afraid it's David, gonna jingle against the, uh, yeah, the microphone. David, I think every morning you need to wear that. I just wear this yeah. when I do the news. We yeah. have so much oh. nice on My you. bosses may have something to say about that. <laughs> Beautiful. Well, and this is indoors too. Oh, this one great. is indoors at the Let Union Trust Theater building. A beautiful theater, if you've ever seen it on the 10th floor of the Union Trust. It's gorgeous. We always love oh. when you guys stop by. I have been there have before. You been there? Yes, yeah. it's Isn't a great, great space. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah it's like hidden up there. Body it's great. Yeah, you know? It's very yeah. hidden. Well, you All don't right, want to miss thanks. this. Again, the play runs from April 23rd through April 26th, a very short run, so make sure to check it out. You can find all the details on our website, PittsburghTodayLive.com. Yeah, this might be too flashy for me. Remember I don't this? Think so. <laughs> all right, up next. True. They're loving